here. Imagine that. Six more months and we're out of here of 2024. Yeah, that's what it is, guys. And it's also hump day, which means I have hump day love for you all. Of course I have hump day love for you all because I love you all. Today we're going to uh, give some love to everyone who's celebrating Pride Month. Happy Pride Month. The month of June is Pride Month where we're celebrating folks being comfortable to be themselves. So happy Pride Month to the uh, LGBTQ community as they take pride in who they are and whom they love. That's what it's all about for the lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, and queers. Happy Pride Month, everyone who's out celebrating and supporting someone who's celebrating. And as a reminder, pride is important because someone tonight still believes they're better off dead than being themselves. How sad is that? That someone would rather be dead than to just be themselves because they're loving someone of the same sex or... You know, because they're bi and love, you know, both sexes, just whatever someone's sexual preference is, shouldn't be a reason of not loving them. We should embrace everyone. Remember, love is love, okay? So let's just uh, be kinder and celebrate those who are just loving themselves and comfortable in their skins. Happy Pride Month, guys. Enjoy yourselves. Okay, I have an episode where I discuss uh, my family and uh, growing up when I have uh, well had a gay uncle, my uncle Sonny, whom I still love and I will never forget and cherish his love. That uh, episode was out June 16, 2021. That was in our season one, episode 17. It's conventional versus alternative. Yeah, I got really emotional on that show. So I got all chucked up talking about my uncle Sonny and the pride. I felt in my family in the 70s how they embraced a black man being gay and, you know, how he would come around and bring his partners and we never knew until we were adults like, oh, that was uh, Uncle Sonny's, you know, boyfriend, partner, what have you. And when he would dress up in his um, hot pants, you know, he probably started the Daisy Dukes long before Dukes of Hazard said uh, he would put on a wig and get around with his sisters and dance and they would cheer him on. And I just thought how beautiful our family was to support him in that manner. My grandfather, my grandmother, everyone loved him, although they didn't see him with the dress and he'd wait till they took off and then get loose. You know, anyway, check out that.